another assist. Back to Nash, she cranks up a three. Shazam! Super shot time for the Nash Rambler. Nash is a Suns legend because he was one of the best players to ever play. He was probably the second best player to ever wear a Phoenix Suns uniform behind Charles Barkley, and I think you could even debate the other. I mean, Nash was, Nash redefined, along with Mike D'Antoni, Steve Nash redefined basketball for an entire generation of fans. It's the fact on what he did to the organization, to the city, as far as uplifting the Valley and putting the Suns back on the map, not just locally, but nationally, something that Charles Barkley was able to do when he arrived in town. December of 2011, coming off the lockout, second game of the year, they played a terrible Philadelphia 76ers team and Steve Nash probably had his worst game ever that night. He was like one of six from the field. He had one assist, uh, six turnovers. He played horribly, and I remember thinking, uh, I was witnessing history, because he never had bad games. Uh, now he was on the downside of his career at that point, but it stood out to me that that's how consistent he was from an, on a night in, night out basis, that he avoided games like that. Uh, that game always stuck out to me as kind of the anomaly in his career while he was here in Phoenix. What makes Nash a legend with the Suns is very obvious. It's two MVPs and an era in which the Phoenix Suns won a lot. No, they didn't win a championship. No, they didn't get to the NBA Finals. But they were relevant every single year. They were contenders every single year. And they made some deep runs into the playoffs. So that is why Nash is such a Suns legend.